29. Needs almost half a second. red as he got back to the gas coming up off turn number four yeah well that's because he's in fifth gear and the car is just not accelerating off the corner uh, like Denny Hamlin's car did so you know I think Bubba Bubba made it work really good leaving it in fifth gear but I, do, I still don't think that's the the correct strategy well that will lock Bubba Wallace into the final round here's Martin Truex since the start of 2019, he's won one of every three races here. He's the point leader. And he bumps in by two one thousandths of a second over Hamlin. Well, with three cars to go here, the scenario we're talking about is on the table, but it's obviously not for Truex, just barely being there with the 22. I think he's going to lock in for now, but I, I worry. Second lap is slower. So that knocks uh, Hamlin out of the fast five, and it will lock uh, Austin Sendrick into the final round, where there were no Fords in the final round last week. Down to Bell and William Byron here. I right. see a lot, Whoa. a lot of right. Way loose getting into one. He's going to have to run two for sure. Well, he's Three happy. group here, Christopher. He's happy he did that in, in turns one and two. Not in three and four, because if he did that down here, it would ruin both laps. He's got one shot now. Not gonna, not gonna be the lap Christopher Bell wanted. Nope. Gets a bit of a pickup, but he's looking at uh, the 14th row for Sunday. All right, that will lock in Todd Gilliland to the final round. It's now William Byron against Martin Truex for the final spot. Third straight year, William has started the season off with multiple wins. the center not enough a 23 man it was close Kevin he needs a hundredth it was that close to being able to save one lap on his tires I can't help oh, but he to think that wasn't in the plan just barely missed it got him nope yeah, yeah. No. Second lap is slower for Byron, so Truex will advance.